Ni hao. Welcome back to Auntie Dan's Kitchen. Today Auntie will be cooking stir fried mixed spice buffalo meat with mantou. So come let's join Auntie. Alright friends, these are the ingredients I have for today's video. The main ingredient, this one is buffalo meat. I already sliced it and make it into strips. And I'm going to marinate this buffalo meat with a fennel powder, one t tablespoon. And then this one, coriander powder, one tablespoon. And about one teaspoon of cumin powder. And of course, peppercorn. This one I already pounded. And followed by four cloves of garlic. One shallot, an inch of ginger. This one I'm going to pound later on. And of course, I'm going to put a bit of this soy sauce. A light soy sauce. And of course, salt and ajinomoto. So stay tuned guys. Garlic. Followed by ginger. Okay, add to the buffalo meat, the sliced buffalo meat. And all the spices, black peppercorn pounded, this is light soy sauce, I'm using about 2 tablespoons, okay for the gravy. All right. One teaspoon of salt. And half teaspoon of ajinomoto. Okay. That's it. Okay, one tablespoon of cooking oil. Okay. All right, let's mix it. Mm, nice smell. Alright, I have 2 tablespoons of corn flour and this will act as a tenderizer for the meat and also I'm gonna put this is thick soy sauce 1 tablespoon 2 tablespoon and 3 tablespoon okay 3 tablespoon of thick soy sauce Okay, I'm gonna mix it. I'm going to put mixed herbs. Okay, done.
All right, it's fully mixed. So it's like this. So I'm going to leave this to marinate for about half an hour. Then I will proceed with the cooking. Stay tuned, guys. All right, friends, it's time to start the cooking to stir fry this buffalo meat that I marinated for about half an hour. And now I'm going to proceed. Okay, I have uh, four cloves of garlic that I already chopped and also about an inch of ginger. I slice it thinly like this heat up the oil. I like to stir fry the ginger first. Till it's aromatic. Okay, add in the garlic. Okay, put in the buffalo meat. And stir fry. While still frying this meat, I'm going to boil water to steam this mantou for about 10 minutes only just to warm up the bun or the mantou and this one is going to eat with the meat later on with all the garnishing. Okay, stay tuned guys. Okay, continue to stir fry the meat.
okay I'm going to add hot water into the meat and let it continue to simmer okay not so much all right done Okay, cover it to let it simmer. Okay. Okay, this is how the steam mantles look like. It has been steamed for 10 minutes. Alright, while waiting for the buffalo meat to get simmered, auntie is prepared for this condiment. This one is cabbage, shredded cabbage. And I have two shallot already sliced. And fresh chili, as well as half of the carrot slice. Alright, it's done. Auntie cooked this one for about an hour or so to tenderize the meat. already and follow the flowing process okay it's time to fill the mantel with the buffalo meat that is been cooked garnish with cabbage carrot and the buffalo meat mm. <gasps> wow yummy and fresh shallot and some chili okay that's it you can use any meat that you want you can use beef chicken or even smoked fish that's your choice or might as well you might might want to try this buffalo meat all right friends this is the ending of auntie's cooking just now stir fry mixed spice buffalo meat with mantel do subscribe like comment and share and by the way do try the recipe it's very delicious have a nice day thanks for watching may god bless all